Hello fellow teammates, welcome back to the IN team and to our next installment of Is It Worth It? This is a video where we break down each item within the monthly installment of GTA Plus and give you our honest opinions to help you decide if subscribing is right for you. Now, as usual, we are not recommending the subscription, but for those of you who are thinking about picking it up, here's our breakdown on this month's benefits. So first off, the things that remain unchanged from last month was a 500000 in GTA currency that's automatically delivered to your Maze Bank account and your access to the GTA Plus shark cards. There's no free businesses this month. Instead, you receive a couple free nightclub upgrades, which are the light rig customizations and extra cargo storage floors. And this is really disappointing. To have access to these free upgrades, you have to own a nightclub, meaning you'll have to purchase one if you don't already own one. And unfortunately, this month's benefits seem to focus on the nightclub business. So if that's not a business you own, want, or are planning on starting, then this month's subscription may not be for you. The free vehicle this month is a terabyte, which can be picked up at the Warstock Cash and Carry. This armored and weaponized command center would normally set you back a little over 1.3 million. And this vehicle is part of the nightclub business. That's the only place it can be stored. So you must own a nightclub in order to pick this up. And the Terabyte is a very handy vehicle. This is probably our most used command center. It houses a weapons workshop for the Mach 2 weapons, as well as a vehicle workshop for the Presser Mach 2. You can also store your Presser and the Terabyte. The Terabyte also can be upgraded with a command turret and drone stations. And purchasing one also gives you access to client jobs. So it's really handy. But like we said, a nightclub is required to own one of these, so if you're not in the market to pick one of those up, we suggest skipping this month's subscription. On to the bonuses. Subscribers will be able to request vehicles and utilize CEO and VIP abilities for free. You'll also receive double money in RP on terabyte client jobs, two times the supplies on business battles, and three times the nightclub warehouse production speed. No surprise on the free CEO and VIP abilities. They have been in three of the last four months of GTA+. Plus. So they're practically standard with the subscription now. And the terabyte client jobs, they are pretty fun. If you haven't played these, we suggest giving them a run through. But will they make you a lot of money? No. The terabyte client jobs was one of the elements that did not receive a payout increase with the Criminal Enterprises DLC. As you can see here, we only made 60,000 for completing the diamond shopping job. And that's with double money. So it's 30,000 normally. For comparison, we completed a headhunter, one of the VIP jobs from the executive business and its payout was increased with the Criminal Enterprises DLC. We received 40,000 for completing this, and it only took two minutes. All the new payout increases added to other elements in the game really cast a shadow on these jobs, and it's a shame because they are a lot of fun. Now the double supplies on business battles is a nice perk, but players who don't play in public lobbies will not have access to this, and if you ever engage in one of these in a public lobby, you know they get wild. We can't count how many times we've seen high-level players circling the building where the supplies are stored, waiting to pick off the lower levels when they exit. And a 3 times nightclub warehouse speed is great. The nightclub warehouse is one of the best passive income businesses in the game. That boost will definitely help increase your banking account. But like everything else in this month's description, a nightclub is required. And you'll actually have to own a few businesses in order to fully benefit from this. To take full advantage of this bonus, you'll also need to own all the MC businesses, a special cargo warehouse or a hangar, and a gun running bunker. There are seven types of goods, which are classified by the type of business and are only available if the player already owns the corresponding business. Oh, and you'll also need to hire and allocate technicians to each business to cure the product. So this bonus is really for veteran players. Most of them will already own all the other businesses and have their nightclub warehouse set up. Our suggestion to new players is to purchase the cheapest location in each business type or skip this month's subscription. This brings us to the discounts. This month, there's 35% off Mach 2 weapon upgrades in the weapons workshop. And the 35% off is only for the upgrade to the Mach 2 variation of the weapon. All customizations and tents are regular price, which is a bummer because the customizations can get pretty expensive. The one good thing about this discount is that it is also available in other weapon workshops. On to the clothing. This month, subscribers will receive the pumpkin hoodie, gray crack puppet mask, grimy stitched mask, and the mummy bodysuit. The mask and bodysuits offered this month are awesome. This is the first bodysuit we've seen where the wounds you receive while gaming actually improve the look. The only article that was lacking in our opinion is the pumpkin hoodie. This hoodie had potential, but with a quick glance, you can tell it's extremely pixelated. And in case you're wondering, you're unable to raise or lower the hood while you're wearing one of the masks. And as a reminder, 
A GTA Plus subscription can be purchased directly from the PlayStation or Microsoft Store or from within GTA Online on PS5 and Xbox Series X and S. Also, you will have to claim all items individually yourself at their respective in-game realtors. You will be unable to claim anything you miss once the next month's subscription begins, so be sure to get everything right away. So after reviewing everything, we gave this month's subscription a 2 out of 10. This is the first month we feel is geared towards experienced players, but it's still pretty awful. Definitely not worth it. Veterans will be able to take advantage of the business battles and the nightclub warehouse production speed, but will not receive a new vehicle. The terabyte is a benefit targeted to new players. Most veterans will already have one of these, and new players won't have access to 90% of what's in this month's subscription if they don't already own a nightclub and most of the supporting businesses. To fully benefit from everything offered this month, you will have to dish out, or will have had to dish out, close to $8 million. You only receive $500,000 with a subscription. That won't even cover 10% of the cost. It's a little odd that Rockstar didn't offer a nightclub for free. If bonuses are being offered for a particular business, you would naturally think at least one location for that business would be free, or at least on discount. Anyway, if you already have a nightclub, and all the other businesses, then this will be a decent month for you. But we say skip this month if you have to purchase everything to get started. But that's our thoughts. Now we want to know yours. Are you planning on picking up a subscription this month or waiting to the next? Do you already own a nightclub? What about the MC businesses? Are you willing to purchase them to take advantage of this month's bonuses? Let us know down in the comments. We'd love to hear from you. And thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed this video, a like really helps us out. But if you're new, you should really consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell. Because we release several videos on GTA Plus, GTA News, and updates each month. But as always, thanks again, and we'll see you next time, teammates.